Welcome to another episode of Matthew Jordan Presents, where today we're gonna talk about New Year's resolutions. Woo! Uh, Reggie Crook. Reggie what? Crook, see Reggie Crook? Yeah, Is that I'm, the, I'm the legal crook. Okay, okay, and then I'll, yo, what's your New Year's resolution this year, Susan? Um, to work on my anger management. Yeah, I was turning into a snapper. What's your New Year's resolution, Mr. Crook? Uh, to retire, get me a townhouse, put a fence around it, get a barbecue grill, and a big dog named Brutus. So you have to prophesize your New Year. So whatever you man think is and believe is, you achieve it. I was identity theft by my ex-girlfriend, so it's, it's complicated. Wait, what'd you say about your ex-girlfriend? She was identity theft me. Oh, she identity theft you? Yeah, she, she, she basically uh, kidnapped my child. She and, kidnapped your child? Yeah, she put three hits on me. My, my, my attorney, Donald E. Simone, and Anna Smart tried to kill me. She, she launders money for a big drug dealer. Actually, right down the street here, his name's One Stop Shop. She decided to identity theft me and kill me. All right, guys, subscribe to Matthew Jordan Presents. He's a cool guy, so. Do you have any crazy New Year's Eve stories back in the day when you were cutting up the rug? Oh, man. Oh, man. Uh, smoking a punch bowl full of weed. What? Smoking a punch bowl full of weed? Yeah. How do you do that? It's hard by the yard, but it's a cinch by the end. And then, yo, what's the craziest thing you ever seen out in these streets? Somebody was smoking a crack pipe, and police rolled right by them, and they kept on smoking. They ain't stopped. Oh, you're allowed to do crack in downtown. Yeah. What's the craziest guest you've had that you've served here? Two clients got into it and uh, one of them choked the other one. So the security came to pick up the guy because I didn't know if the guy was dead on the floor or, or needed medical assist, medical attention or something. So I thought, you know, security, you need to call the ambulance. And How about Bitcoin? Have you ever thought about investing in Bitcoin? I don't know what Bitcoin is, man. Well, it's like the new rage in town. Sorry, bro, but I don't know. I'm not with the new rage in town, remember? Right. I'm old school, dog. I don't know. And then, yo, what do you think is more valuable, Bitcoin or a Super Mario coin? What the heck? Super Mario coin. Okay. Super Mario coin. Super Mario coin. There you go. <laughs> right, right? What about Bitcoin or Chuck E. Cheese tokens? <laughs> Chuck E. Cheese tokens. <laughs> I'll rather have the Dave & Buster's tokens. <laughs> Dave & Buster's tokens, okay, okay. What about Bitcoin or a Sonic the Hedgehog rings? Chuck E. Cheese coins. All right, right, because you, you get prizes, huh? You get prizes, huh? Hey, with Chuck E. Cheese. Do you have anything you want to say to your fans? Yeah. She's, she's, she's sleeping with some other guy, and with my child, and I am don't have a girlfriend at all, and I'm trying to get back on my feet so I can get my child back. Pump your brakes, stay out the diamond lane. <laughs> it's hard by the yard, but it's a cinch by the inch. Life has road signs, pay attention. Uh, subscribe to Matthew Jordan Prevent. Please subscribe to Matthew Jordan Prevent. <laughs> you would not be only doing yourself a favor, but your dog will like you, your cat will be waving at you. 